Cheers everyone, this is Blaster Brewmaster here, and welcome to Scrap Mechanic! What is Scrap Mechanic? I don't know, but I am in the middle of a big cornfield. These are the biggest things of corn I have ever seen. And there are things off in the direction over there. Okay, you know what? We gotta have to... You know, we're, we're gonna come back to all that in a second. So Scrap Mechanic, what is that? Well, I don't want to use some terms that come to mind, but I mean, if you look down here at the bottom, I mean, you kind of think... First thing that comes to mind is what? Minecraft, right? Well, no, no, it's not Minecraft. Um, I guess in some ways you could say it's like you build stuff, like, you can think of like kind of like Besiege in Minecraft, kind of in a similar sense. You build things with it. And see, nice thing here is you have a little platform where you can start building them. And then we go off and we start laying down the blocks, like, yeah, like Minecraft. Okay, fine, say it, say it with me. Like Minecraft, but, all right? So, no, it's not Minecraft out. Oh, wait until we actually get to doing things. Then you can go and say, like Minecraft, but. So, I'm gonna build myself a vehicle so I can get around here. Okay. So now, here, and, oh, you know what I forgot I can do is I can lift this lift up here. There. Why was I going and thinking that I had to go that way? Okay. Well, I'm gonna make these things go here. Okay, and then, so, over here on this little left thing, you've got your mechanic's handbook. So, this is about building machines, alright? This isn't about building whatever you want. You're building machines. This is why it's called Scrap Mechanic. It's not Scrap House Builder. Okay, now, here's a car. This is what I'm trying to build right now. So, now we need to put some engine mount and... Oh, maybe this is what I need to do. Here. No, mm, we'll do something else like that. Um, okay. So we need to put an engine and we need to put seats on here. And lift and lower that. Okay. So, first, we want to have you up here. Uh, up, 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 up. Gotta place it all pretty. There we go. Oh, right. And now, what do we do here? So we raise this back up again. There we go. Okay. So now we put these little swivelly thingy wingies on here. And over here, underneath. Okay, now we can put these. Okay, so these are mounted to the little swivel thingies. And you see we're like kind of drilling them in or something. I don't know what exactly we're doing. Ah! Hey! Don't put that too close to me. And then I think we put more of these things like on the outside here. Like so. And there. And now we can put tires. Yep, see? And now we're getting ourselves a little big rig. Yep. I wonder if I could get bigger tires because then I'd just make myself a monster truck. That'd be pretty freaking sweet. <laughs> Watch out, corn! You will not be able to stand in the way of Bigfoot! Okie doke. Uh, we got the engine on the back. Now we need to connect things together. So, see the little dots here? This, um, uh, you know, this kind of looks like one of those things from Ghostbusters, you know, where it's like, do -do 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 -do, you know, trying to figure out where exactly the ghosts are. Okay, so we take this, click and drag it to here. Wait, no, over here. See, okay, now we can see that the engine and the steering wheel is combined. Uh, let's go back to the manual, because I need to see exactly how we do everything. Okay, so, see, we connect that together, um, and I think we've done... Oh, we only needed those on the front. Hmm. Well, let's just see what exactly happens when we do it this way. Who says we need to really pay attention to manual, huh? Just give it some good old go. Let's go ahead and connect these together. So we connect these to the engine like so, right? Okay. And... There. Okay, now we connect these things up here to the tires. And let's just see what happens if we do it for this. Four-wheel drive, four-wheel steering. Sounds like a great idea. We're going to switch this around because otherwise it's probably going to go... Backwards, yeah, it looks like it would go backwards otherwise. And then, I guess we're also gonna turn this around here and 
ear. Okay. Come on. Lower, lower, lower. Okay, now I guess just get rid of you. Okay, now what do I do? You said... Press E to use. Uh, like that. Okay. And then we close. And get in. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> now I... <laughs> Whoopsies! Look at this! <laughs> Look at me go! It's like a fucking Bronco! But yeah, well, I guess you don't do it that way, huh? <laughs> okay, I, I, I want off the ride. Mom, I want off the ride! Oh my god! Uh, okay, uh, let's go back to the instruction manual. Maybe we put too much uh, power to that. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, we might have put a little bit too much power. Okay, um, let's also... Let's see, can we undo that? Okay, let's... Okay. Let's just take this off of here. And... Let's turn this all the way down here. Okay. <laughs> oh, I did not expect that. Okay. I got a big hammer here, too. Boom! Let's try the... Did you see her neck there for a moment? Okay, uh... Maybe we took the rotation off of the wrong thing? Okay, yeah, we need to... Okay, okay. Alright, so we need to take this back down here, I think. Let's, uh... Take all this off of here. Whoa, whoa, no, 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 no! No oh, shite. Uh, is there a way I can knock this back down that way? You know what? Hold on. May be able to still work with this. We'll see exactly how all this goes here. Don't ever let it be said that I know what I'm doing. That would be the biggest mistake of your life, to think that I actually have any clue what I'm doing when it comes to mechanics. I am building things that are hopefully working. Um, so these are all supposed to turn in the same direction, though. Okay, uh, let's try this again and see how we can get this thing turned over now. Um, hold on. No. Hammer, are you gonna do this? No. Hold on, hold on, I make... There we go! Ha! Whoever said beating a problem senseless with a hammer didn't doesn't work well they're wrong okay let's try this again with all of the crazy head going everywhere sort of thing hmm. uh, e e engine you got power to you right okay well hold on okay there we go ooh lucky <laughs> we're finally driving around now Okay, let's go and see what we can find over here. Woohoo! Center of balance might be a little bit uh, kind of off on this thing. Good thing we didn't turn it up to full power, though. Oh, it's steering's kind of a little tight on it. Testing pad! Okay, this is a great little thing. I have no idea if there's anything to do with these little towers or anything yet, but that is just freaking awesome. Okay, sweet. I may have to definitely kind of come back here and play, do some more stuff with this. Uh, let's see. Let's put up something new now. Now we've got a flat surface, and I've got a little dune buggy here. Which is probably like, uh, I don't even know what I'm going to do with this. Let's see. Let's, uh, now let's come back to it. Okay, what else can we build? So, let's see. That's how to build a vehicle. These are the bearings, which allow us to rotate. Um, uh, hmm. What does that do, though? I don't even... Anything you can attach to a bearing will rotate. Can be powered by an engine or when linked to a controller using the connect tool. And when connected to a driver's seat, bearings can be controlled with a keyboard. Okay, here's the lift. So this is just what? Talking about the different things we can... Now we can use these. Connecting tool, driver's seat, gas engine, thruster. Ooh. Because the I button gives me... There we go. Sports suspension. Ooh, off-road suspension. Huh. Let's, uh, 
In fact, let's do that. Let's see if we can put an off-road suspension on this thing. Alright, we gotta we gotta work on the we gotta work on the buggy here. Alright, Jim. Wait, hold on. We gotta lower it a little bit. Jim, lower it. Alright, Jim. Okay, there we go. That's good. That's good, Jim. Okay. Take all these things off of here. Uh that works. Like, whoa. That is a lot bigger than I thought it would be. Okay, so now then let's put the suspension here. Okay, so now we put them on here, right? So we have something to mount the tires to. On oh, these concrete brick bricks, mind you, that's just kind of funny. And this thing is going to be off-roading like mad! Alright. Let's just see exactly, because I feel like we're going to have to definitely kind of modify a little bit of the top, too. I wonder if I can actually, hold on, can I get on this for a moment? I'm like wondering if I can do this. Oh, I can! <laughs> That's one way to do this. Sweet! Got my own little elevation system. Alright, well, I need, I think, to kind of pretty this up a bit. Put a little roll cage in it, because I'm going to be going off-roading. There we go. So, now it has a bit of a roll cage. Except for the front part, you know what I mean? I suppose I could probably do something about that. Let's kind of do that real quick. Whoa! What the heck just happened there? Holy crud monkeys. Um, that might just be a little too unwieldy. Get rid of that. Yeah, I have no idea how that happened. Okay, that's good enough for me. Let's get in this beast now. See? Now we have a bit of a roll cage to this, too. I mean, it's not exactly the cleanest thing, but... Uh, hmm. Something's not right here. Oh, it might be because of the fact that I've got it... So much stuff on it. Let's turn that power up a bit. Ah! Jeez, my character freaking out. Whoa! Okay. Ah. Uh, okay. Tires are rotating as they should be. Oh, right, we need to... Oh, okay, okay, okay. I know what we need to do. Yes, that's... Okay, that's all good. Let's turn that power back down before we go and... kill ourselves. Which, I mean, you know, would be fun and all in its own right, but... we want to take this off-roading before we go and kill ourselves. It's the fun thing to do. Okay. Okay, uh... Ah! Nope. That's why I put the roll cage in. Um. Well, I didn't exactly see this coming. Okay. Hold on. I can fix this. I can fix this. By beating it repeatedly. Or, you know what? Hold on. I got a better idea. I mean, normally beating a solution with a hammer is my go-to. But I think... That works a little bit better. Okay. Can, can we... Can you get down, please? Okay, wow. You can actually get really high up in there. I didn't realize that. Okay. So, that's one half of the problem. The other half of the problem... Go! Oh! Turn over! Uh... I don't, I don't know how to get this back up now. Why don't you get... Get up! Roll over! Roll over! Roll over! Maybe if I try something like this? I'm beating the solution until it works, but it's not working. No! Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. Come on. Come on, come on. There we go, there we go! Yes! No, no! Damn it, I almost had it. There we go. Okay. Ah, so. There. Now we're finally back on it. There we go. Uh, this thing is way too top heavy. You know what we need? We need some counterbalancing. 
Probably shouldn't have used concrete for this whole thing, because that's probably another problem here. Okay. Is it more balanced now? Let's find out. Yes, it is. Okay. Now, hopefully, when I go driving around here... <laughs> okay, no, that's that's not working at all. Okay, okay, I'm, I'm down. I am down for the count, I think. Uh... So, yeah, maybe I should have just... Hmm. Oh, that's how you do it. Okay, that makes it better. There. Now then, well, let's just go ahead and see... Okay, these do need to be turned around. Rotate! Okay. There we go. Ah! Engineering! Engineering! Ingenuity! Engineering! Engineering! Team! Engineering! -ing -ing. Yes. All those words. That is what I am good at now. See? Now I'm gonna go off and get myself an engineering degree and not get myself a job in engineering because it affects there's no market for it anymore. Ha <laughs> ha! Topical! But look at this! Look at this glorious beast! So the problem was the fact that it was so top-heavy, so I decided to lower the center of gravity. I tried that the first time, and all it did was just make it, like, outside of my wheels and tip me over real quick. So instead, I just put it on this. Now, the problem is also that this base is kind of a little bit not, you know, wielding control enough, but I think that's enough for now here, because I don't know that there's too much in here yet, but I mean, I just think that it's kind of fun to be able to create these little creations and engines and stuff that go and drive and do things. So I got to play around with this a bit more, I think, and find out what else I can make here. Wee -hee -hee! Oh, and I'm over again. Well, either way, I think that we're going to go ahead and call this here. So thank you for going ahead and joining me here today on Scrap Mechanic. If you like this video, go ahead, give it a like, a comment, and subscribe. Whatever you feel like it. I always like to hear from you. So let me hear from you, the viewer. In the meantime, go ahead and raise your kind of seltzer in the air. And have another one on me. Love and peace. Move around. Get as many as I can. Wait. Uh. You idiot. In this world, it's kill or be killed. Holy crap. I didn't exactly. Why would anyone pass up an opportunity like this? Okay, well. Huh. Okay, uh, e, uh, what, what? Okay.